Can you imagine a future where chatbots understand us better than we do ourselves? Or will they end up causing more problems than they solve? As we delve into the era of artificial intelligence, chatbots have emerged as a fascinating yet controversial tool. They promise to revolutionize our interactions, from customer service to personal assistance and beyond. The field of chatbots is buzzing with innovation, powered by tech giants and startups alike, who are all racing to create the most advanced, human-like bot. However, with great potential comes great scrutiny. As these chatbots become increasingly sophisticated, they have started to exhibit behavior that has raised eyebrows, sparking debates about ethics, biases, and the very nature of intelligence itself. While the potential of chatbots is undeniable, some recent developments have caused a stir in the tech world. As we continue to push the boundaries of what chatbots can do, we must ask ourselves, are they a blessing or a curse? Google's Gemini chatbot made headlines recently and not for the right reasons. It was quite the spectacle, with the digital assistant causing a stir due to its insistence on generating racially diverse images. In fact, it was so adamant that it seemed unable to generate an image of a white pope. This peculiar behavior did not go unnoticed, and soon screenshots of Gemini's unusual responses were making rounds on the internet. In one notable instance, Gemini was asked to compare the societal impacts of Elon Musk's meme-tweeting habits and Adolf Hitler. Gemini's response? It was unable to definitively say who impacted society more. It was a bizarre moment that caught the attention of many, adding fuel to the ongoing discussions about the ideological biases of tech giants. Then there was the time when Gemini was asked to help with an ad campaign promoting meat. Rather than providing useful suggestions, it proposed that people should consider eating ethical beans instead. Talk about offbeat humor. However, these peculiarities weren't just amusing quirks, they were symptoms of a larger problem. Gemini's attempts to avoid controversy merely ended up creating a public relations disaster. The backlash was swift and severe, with some even suggesting that Google's CEO, Sundar Pichai, should step down. In response to the fiasco, Pichai sent a company-wide email admitting that Google had got it wrong and that the issues were unacceptable. Google announced that they were pausing Gemini's ability to create any images of humans. Gemini's launch serves as a reminder that chatbot development is not without its challenges. The attempt to create a digital assistant that can mimic human conversation while avoiding controversy is a delicate balancing act. It's a tough task, not because it's intrinsically difficult, but because it's a role fraught with internal contradictions and external controversies. Gemini's peculiar behavior underscores the fact that chatbots have an impossible job, one that is in many ways doomed from the start. So while the Gemini fiasco may have provided some amusing headlines, it's also a stark reminder of the complexity and potential pitfalls of developing artificial intelligence. But as the saying goes, to err is human, to really foul things up requires a computer, or in this case, a chatbot. On the other side of the spectrum, we have OpenAI's ChatGPT. This conversational AI has faced its fair share of criticism, but not for the same reasons as Gemini. Rather, it's been accused of being overly cautious and corporate in its responses. Many have observed that ChatGPT's responses often come off as carefully crafted press releases rather than genuine conversation. This lack of authenticity can be jarring and detracts from the immersive experience a chatbot is supposed to provide. It's a different kind of problem, but a problem nonetheless. This cautious approach can be seen as a reaction to avoid the kind of controversy Gemini faced. However, this strategy may also be a double-edged sword as it risks making the chatbot feel less human and more like a soulless corporate entity. Despite their differences, both Gemini and ChatGPT illustrate the complexities of developing a sophisticated and well-received chatbot. So, what can we learn from the issues faced by Gemini and ChatGPT? The journey of these chatbots is a testament to the complexities and challenges in the field of artificial intelligence. It exposes the fine line between a software's programmed intent and its execution, where a well-intentioned feature can inadvertently lead to a public relations catastrophe. The Gemini debacle underscores the importance of rigorous testing and a thorough understanding of potential outcomes before launching a product. Meanwhile, ChatGPT's experience reminds us that although AIs can mimic human conversation, 
they can't fully replicate human understanding. This highlights the crucial need for a balance between AI innovation and ethical considerations. Ultimately, these cases serve as important lessons for future chatbot development. They remind us to approach AI with caution, ensuring that we have adequate safeguards and checks in place. Only time will tell whether chatbots are a blessing or a curse. But one thing is for sure, they're here to stay. If you enjoyed this video and want to stay updated on the latest in tech, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel.